We are currently being escorted in. You're gonna notice a, a small golf truck in front of me. That is the lady that is running this event by the name of Jackie. She reached out to your boy, said, Dame, New Haven's about to do a major. You need to be a part of this movement because you're, you're from Connecticut and your boy gets that special access. But because I get the special access, that means the foodie fam receives the same special access. I'm gonna try to jump on as much food as possible. And I know next week I'm gonna be real heavy into the fitness game because it's about to get real crazy for your boy. But we're here, baby. We are here. Dame's getting that special parking. Ooh. And let me apologize for the background noise. A lot of things are going on here. I'm across from the highway. I got the background sounds popping off. Plus, I got the AC going. So you probably hear all type of craziness in the audio. YouTube, Facebook, Twitter. She made me a Dame Drops back in with another Super, Super Official. Food if you can't think of baby, I know you can't. Hey, listen, man. As you guys can see behind me, I'm out here in New Haven, Connecticut. I'm Long Wharf, about to beat up Rick D's Rib Shack food truck. And I passed by so many food trucks, man, I didn't know which one to jump on for the super official food review. If you want to see some behind the scenes of this food truck festival, I want you to go ahead and click right here. Click this annotation. It's going to take you to Dame Vlog. Be sure to subscribe. That's my vlog channel where everything else under the sun is popping off. All right. I just want to open this thing up, man. I just want to... I just want to... Ooh. Would you look at these ribs? Are these ribs glazed up to perfection or what? Oh, come on, daddy. Smoked up, charred up. You don't know nothing about that heavily seared and rib game. And if your ribs don't look official like this, you must be eating those suspect ribs. Then I have some barbecue baked beans over here posted up too. Let's go, I'm hungry. Some wet wipes for my fingers after I beat these ribs up. I appreciate that, man. If you have a rib shack, you don't have wet wipes. You're doing something wrong. You better get your life right. Got my utensils for the beans, of course, because I'm a G. I'm going to just eat these ribs. I'm not going to be cutting in the ribs, taking pieces of rib on my fork. I never learned to eat ribs like that when I was little. I'm not going to start doing it now. You know, that's Hollywood, and I'm so Hollywood. Let's go. I'm gonna get to the ribs last. I wanna beat these beans up first, though. Mm hmm. Woo! Hold up now. Mm. I can't quite put my finger on the proper spice game on this one. The best way I can describe the beans to you, for those of you that are not in the area and you'll never ever make it out to New Haven. I wouldn't, I wouldn't compare them to Campbell's beans. I compare them more so to, to Bush's beans. Mesquite barbecue. Smoked to that perfection of love. Hold me long time. Because these beans, they are holding the flavor long time. All up inside my mouthpiece. Mmm. Alright, uh-uh. Oh, why you, oh, why you like that though? Smoked up. Mm-hmm. 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 Y'all know I keep it 100, right? This is just me in the spot keeping it hot for you. The bees were a problem in a good way because of that home barbecue flavor right there. I'm talking about not that canned sauce. This is like that, we're gonna make these beans straight from scratch. The same way they made the sauce that's been marinated up on the ribs, something proper. I've had a lot of ribs in my lifetime. I gotta keep it funky with you. 
the heavy meat game on the rib can be defeated when it's been smoked for a long time and when you go to pull the bone, the meat, it just fall off. There's no support. There is no bra strap on those ribs. No support to this fall. Badoop, badoop. And Ricky D's is definitely that home barbecue love on the sauce that's been lathered up over the rib, seared to a nice crisp on the rib, except the rib just provided too much choo-choo for your boy. Not choo-choo in a bad way, but I was chewing for a long time because that can make or break a situation for me. When I'm tearing down some ribs, I want to be able to hit it. Ooh, don't even give it a chance to, to break up in my teeth properly because it's already just down, moving through the body, moving throughout my soul, and I'm ready to take another bite because the flavor is so crazy. Season right, seared tight, but with a tougher bite than what I like. You feel me? For your ribs, your baked beans, flavors withstanding, a whole lot of choo-choo, nice little bite on the beans. I'm definitely gonna give Ricky D's Rib Shack right now a three-piece for holding me down but uh, I definitely got to try some different things outside of these ribs. The good, they're just not ultra begging for your main man, Dame, right now. I did two. I did two food truck reviews. You, you watch one right now. You can go to my vlog channel and watch a live food truck review at the food truck on my vlog channel. Uh, if you're on a food truck out here in Connecticut, be sure to hit me up. Catch me on Twitter at Dame Drops. Hit me on Instagram, Dame underscore Drops. Catch me on Facebook, Dame Drops, or just send me an email to the business email side of things. If you want to just send me regular mail, that's teamdame at yahoo.com. But business heads out there, food truck owners out there, business at damedrops.net. Be sure to send me a little son, son, holler back and forth, and we'll see if I can get up to your spot. Make it hot. See what you got. Ooh. You enjoyed this video, hit it with a thumbs up. If you hate this video, you don't want to see any more food truck reviews, hit it with a thumbs down. Boo. Boo, boo. Because you know how we get down. Every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Uh. Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Uh. Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Uh. More and more and more. Super, Super official. Photo you can't dig it, baby. I know you can't. Hey, listen, man. Hey guys, you're new to the Foodie Fan, be sure to hit the subscribe button over here at the top and check out my old videos both to the right and to the left of me because you know every single week you made me a Dame Drops gets it and I keep it popping and I'm about to bring you these food truck reviews and I'm about to bring you more food reviews and I'm about to be up in the fitness spot and I'm about to make it hot with the games I got. Oh, I'm killing them!